Hey, here's a quick video explaining the mashup of um, He is Faithful with Angels We Have Heard on High. So um, basically, this is a really simple mashup. If you if you go and listen to and learn um, the parts from worshiponline.com for He is Faithful, uh, you'll be well prepared for this mashup, this arrangement of these two songs. Um, so basically, we're borrowing the, really all of the music, all the instrumentation, all the parts from He is Faithful, and we're inserting Angels We Have Heard on High into He is Faithful with some minor tweaks uh, to the arrangement for this for this to work out. So um, the first change is that the verses, we're chopping off the second half of each verse. So the verses for He is Faithful are G, C, G, C, and then E minor, C, E minor, C for the second half. We're chopping off that second half where it would be E minor, C, E minor, C. We're skipping that and jumping straight to the pre-chorus. Um, so we're kind of surgically removing that eight measures or four measures or whatever it is of the second half of the verse. We're just doing the G, C, G, C, and then we're jumping right into the pre-chorus. And during that time, we're going to sing Angels We Have Heard on High over that G, C, G, C, and then jump right into, and our song it will be, which is the pre-chorus. Um, so I think that makes a minor change to the electric guitar parts. So you're uh, the second half of that verse, you're sliding from a C up to an E minor and back down and stuff. You're going to have to skip that part and then come in on that super high D um, for the pre-chorus. And then your parts are the same from there. So that's really the only change for the verses. Um, and then there's one other change where we're just, we're just chopping out the instrumental between the chorus and the bridge. Um, so that just kind of added too much space and it's, it felt like it was losing momentum uh, with this arrangement. So I just chopped out the, um, it's just, uh, I think it's eight measures of G and C and G and C. Um, very much like the intro, uh, just just pulled that out. So we're going straight from the chorus, um, which is... Hope and joy and love and peace and love So that's the that's the bridge, and instead of he has paid the highest price for that first bridge, we're gonna do Gloria, all with the same all with the same instrumentation, nice and big. The that's still happening. The huge halftime drums are still happening right there. Uh, we're just changing the lyrics instead of singing the natural bridge of He is Faithful, we're singing um, Gloria. Uh, and then for the second bridge, we are going to jump in and sing the actual lyrics for He is Faithful bridge. Um, he has paid the highest price. He's proven his great love for us. So, um, so that change, pulling out that instrumental, shouldn't affect anything really except for the drums. Um, so at the at the the last measure of that instrumental would be kind of a build into the halftime. So um, that'll be represented in the track. I did some some surgery to make sure that the the drums go from that kind of straight beat of the end of the chorus into that build into the into the bridge. So that's happening in the track. So just make sure you catch that. Um, if you listen to the Planning Center, I'm going to post an arrangement of this on Planning Center uh, that represents all these changes with me singing the lyrics of Angels We've Heard on High. So if you listen to that as well, that'll that'll give you kind of the the final touches to your your practice and your prep. Um, but again, the if you practice with the videos for He Is Faithful, you'll be fully prepared. And then at rehearsal, we can always. Uh, talk through the, the changes to the arrangement. So thanks for watching this. Hope that helps. Let me know if you have any questions about this arrangement of He is Faithful matched up with um, Angels We've Heard on High. We'll see you.